and welcome back to my channel. So today's video, as you've seen from the title, it's a crazy one, crazy, 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 because my boyfriend picked the makeup for today and I can't say that I'm really excited about it because he is, well, he has zero knowledge about it. So he basically just, if you've seen from the, from the video, anyway, you'll see, that like he just opens up the drawers and picks whatever, you know, just without even looking what the hell is that. So I'm a bit scared because I didn't see all the products that he picked, but I have them over here, so we're gonna go through it together. I just hoped he picked a few things. Okay, so pick some whatever. Okay, that's a lipstick. Okay, you missed... Oh, oh okay, that's highlighter. Anything else from that drawer? No? <laughs> okay. That's the, that's the palette again. That's that's, <laughs> eye, that's eyeshadow. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Did you, did you look at all the drawers over there? No? Yeah. Haha, <laughs> you need this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, come on. What else? Uh, what does it mean? Seriously? Okay, I have a lot of bobbins, but I don't know. What is that? <laughs> okay. Actually, he's very shy, you know. Okay. Woo! Okay. Nope. Brow products. Okay. Something to make my brow look fantastic, I guess. A marker? <laughs> it's not a marker. It looks like it. Marker. Oh, excellent. Excellent. Oh, oh no, now you picked it up. <laughs> oh my god. That's why it's it's a disaster. Oh god, dear god. We'll pick something. Okay. No. You pick that up. Okay. Whatever. Whatever. Are you done? Are you having more things to, to pick for me? <laughs> well, I can't really use it. Is that all? Is that all? <laughs> so, let me see. Oh, great. He picked a primer. Thanks, God, because you know, if you know me, if you've seen any of the videos before, well, you'll know that I don't go anywhere without my primer. And I'm sorry about the lighting, but the lighting right now, it's a, you know, uh, a natural light from the sun, because yeah, we have sun today. And I'm very, very excited. So uh, let's start. So he picked the one heck of a blog from Soap and Glory, which is my favorite of all, all, all time. So yeah, let's put a little bit, cause a long way. Let me get my mirror, cause you know, you know me and my mirror are like friends forever. I can't go anywhere without it, so yeah. And this is one of my favorite primers, cause it does the job, it just does it. The next thing he picked, oh my god, he picked this foundation for me. It's from Wet n Wild and it's their Photo Fox foundation. Now I've done, I've put this on my, I think January favorites and non favorites, and it was a non favorite because I just, I can't make it work. Like, I don't like it whatsoever. Like, but anyway, we'll go on and we're gonna put it on because you know, that's what he picked for me. So. Good luck to me, but anyway, 
hopefully I won't need too much of a problem so like the foundation is no bother to me it just doesn't really hide much so you know and of course I'm getting my beauty blender he didn't pick it up but you know I didn't really ask him to pick up the blast brushes and stuff so it's okay so uh, yeah let's put a little bit on the underneath area and let's keep going like I do I did like this foundation it just gets it creases a little bit too much for me you know so I don't know but it could be just my bitchness and you know not my whatnot so And as far as you know, I like applying my foundation with a beauty blender because I just prefer it than just the brushes. So, okay, let me see. Is it my go-to? I guess that's how good it's gonna get for my skin anyway. That's how good it's gonna get. So, there you go, you have it. That's the foundation, and then, let me see, did he pick a concealer? Oh, God. <sighs> he picked this concealer from Model Co. It's not that I don't like this concealer, I just wouldn't really use it for under eye area. It's more for cut crease, but let's go on and... Oh, God. It's a good color, but I prefer to have a bit more of a lighter color on me, just so I can work with it. So, yeah, that's what happens. Ah, cool. Okay. So, let's get again the beauty blender and go on. Oh my God, see what I mean? See what I mean? It has a very thick consistency that you can really blend that well even with the beauty blender which i hate i hate on a concealer but obviously he wouldn't know because if he did know he wouldn't have picked this concealer for me to work with i mean i find it difficult to work with but however let's keep trying and i'm gonna put it on my eyelids as well because i don't think he picked an eye primer for my eyes so yeah that's what happens when you pick somebody that doesn't know about makeup to pick up your makeup so you know that's that's it so okay i feel my under eye area it's so so oily that you could just fry an egg in there or something you know I mean that I don't think that this is supposed to be used as a concealer for under eye area or you know a highlighting I guess it's used mostly for cutting creases or stuff like that I don't know but I know that my skin right now looks <sighs> terrible so yeah like I, I, if you can see me shine I don't know what's wrong with you so let's go on and he didn't pick a contouring palette nothing like I have he picked two eyeshadows like he picked an eyeshadow palette which I like and he picked the palette that I have I'm building eyeshadows but I guess what I could do is I could use one of these eyeshadows as my contouring and hope for the best maybe the brown one here and see what happens cause yeah okay let's try it and see how it goes so I'm gonna get my Beauty, K, uh, Beauty UK a contouring palette brush anyway and I'm gonna go really really slow oh my god <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh my god, that's that's just terrible. That is that is just yeah. I I wasn't really oh god. Okay. I guess that. Yeah, maybe 
maybe that wasn't supposed to happen. I don't know. But now, I have to blend like crazy to get it off me. So let me get my contouring brush and try to blend this thing as much as possible. Okay, I think it's it's much better than what it was anyway. Alright, okay. We gave some definition to our face. Now let me go with here really really low. Okay really no with heavy and let's get a little bit on oh my god okay I'm still gonna look like a Numba Loomba trust me <laughs> ah, help okay guys it's not gonna get any better than that I think so let me just put a little bit on my jawline because I need it with whatever it's left now he picked this nose perfector from JD Wady I mean I do love this brush but I don't know whether he was trying to tell me that my nose needs correction or something you know but I'm gonna use it anyway and I'm gonna use this brown over here because I think that's a bit lighter brown and hope for the best Okay, so my contouring would be a little bit here and a little bit here. Oh my god, that's that's just a little bit more than what it's supposed to be. And a little bit here, according to Wayne Gosh. So. Okay, guys, so, oh god. Okay, so there you go, you have it, you, you, you can't really go any better than that. That's how good it's gonna get. I'm telling you, that's how good it's gonna get. Now, he didn't pick a, a blush either, which really annoys me. I mean, how does he think I'm going away like this? Like just, just with this. So I guess I have to play again with my shadows over here and go with maybe this color I'll try and make it work I'm not sure but I'll take really 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 tiny amount because my BH brass is to die for let's take a little bit off and yeah why not that's actually not bad yeah there you go So yeah guys, how to use eyeshadows for blush and contouring. That's what we're doing today. So that's it, I guess. I mean, it's not the best, but it won't get any better than that. So now, the babe was really good and he got me the highlighter and that highlighter is like, oh my god, I love it. It's my all-time favorite. I mean, I always reach for it, and it's from Makeup Revolution. It's a vivid baked highlighter in golden lights, and it's my favorite, favorite, favorite highlighter. Like you're gonna see now what I mean and why it's my favorite one. So I'm gonna put just a little bit here, and boom, there you go. You have it, and a little bit here. And you have the glow of your life. I mean, if you don't see it, there's something wrong with you. And just a little bit on my nose. And we're done. We're done. Done, done, done. I'm not putting too much. I'm not going mental, mentally, you know, weird. Next thing is, oh, thanks God. He got me a brow product and it's my NYX pencil, which I love. So, thank you, Boo Boo. I love you. So let's do the brows really, really quickly. And yeah, you know. So I need, now I do need a mirror, mirror, mirror of the world. It's the most famous of the world. So let's go on and let's correct those bitches.
and hope that they can be twins today and not sisters from another mister so because you know sometimes you have this as well but your brows are like sisters but probably from a different dad or something I don't know after the brows we're going to the eyes obviously so would I play with a prism no I will not play with a prism today I want to do something really crazy so as I am a cray cray and I'm gonna use my palette over here with all the color pop and all the different other um, colors that I have and I'm gonna get my Morphe uh, E27 <coughs> And I need a mirror. And we're gonna go ahead with this babe over here. I don't know if you can see it. It's orange, orangey enough. Anyway, and I'm gonna start with it because I want to. And let's go on. Oh my God. These Colourpop eyeshadows are so pigmented. I just need to put a little bit and look, it's bam, already there. So, I mean, oh my god, I forgot how great these eyeshadows are. And I mean, I don't know why he picked it, maybe because of all these colors that they're so colorful. Maybe he wants to say, oh babe, go for something more colorful than ever. Now, he didn't pick me a setting powder, which kind of irritates me because I kind of need something, you know, to go for. But anyway, we'll, we'll work it out. We'll definitely work it out. So, you know. Now, I might do a sunset look. First color is on, it's lit. I'm gonna go ahead with one more color, which is, I'm gonna go with that. Okay, we're gonna go with the pink, there you go. We're gonna go with that bright pink, because you know I love bright pinks. And yeah, we're gonna do it, we're doing it. And I'm going again with a big fluffy brush, because why not? I'm just going to give it dimension to my eyes. Because I have hooded eyes, and if you don't know what a hooded eye is, it's very hard to work with and to look at the shadows. So, yeah, guys, I mean, most of my shadows are... Let's say you can't see them that well because of the hooded eyes, so like there, not there. Now he didn't pick an eyeliner, so I'm not putting an eyeliner, which, okay, it's not bad, but it's not good either, so, you know, like sometimes you need an eyeliner. And he didn't pick up any, whatsoever, any fake lashes, so, okay, all right. Okay, guys, so I don't know what's happening to my camera, why it's not focusing and whatnot, but f since I finished with my eye over here, I'm gonna do something cray, and so I'm gonna try and cut the crease. I don't know if it's gonna happen, but we'll figure it out together, okay? Because, you know, I'm not that good with that yet. I'm not too good with that yet, but why not? Let's try to cut that crease, bitches. So I'm gonna get again this, where is it? This um, concealer, and let's find out if it's actually gonna work or not. Cause I don't know, we figure it out. So let me just, I'm gonna get one of these synthetic flat brushes cause that's how you do it apparently. So I'm going to do this and leave it there and then, oh my god, it's terrible. This concealer is not even for the crease, not even. Oh my god, okay, that's how good it's gonna get, not good enough, 
but this concealer is definitely not for any use. It's gonna be for my April non favorite whatsoever. So let's try to cut that freaking crease. It even went on my eyelashes. Like, can you believe this? Okay guys, so I'm gonna get one of these brushes, okay, and I'm gonna go through, work out my crease because I feel like some of these things are just... Like this product is still liquid, it's not drying whatsoever and I'm afraid that anything I put on top is gonna look horrible 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 okay it's gonna look really bad so let me just try and fix it as much as I can because it doesn't seem like it's fixing so Okay guys, that's how good it's gonna get. Unfortunately, it's not getting any better. So, yeah. All right, that's, that's, that's great stuff. Great stuff, great stuff. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get my MAC 217, okay? And we're gonna try and do a sunset look or things like that, so. Um, there's nothing in this palette that's white enough, but in the Anastasia palette there is this color over here which I'm going to put on my outside corner of, inner corner of my eye, anyway, yeah, that's it, that's what I'm trying to say, I hope it's going to work. And the other way. And then I'm gonna take this color over here, which is very orangey, and I'm gonna put it on the, well, beside it, beside here, so. That's actually not that bad. I mean, it's not something that I would do, but we could play with colors today and hope for the best. So, yeah. Then, I'm going to go ahead with something more yellowy, and I'm going to go with this color over here. And we'll get that and put it beside the orange and see if it's going to work. It's going to look nice or not. Well, actually, it doesn't look that bad. It doesn't look great, but it doesn't look bad either. If you know what I mean. Do you know what I mean? Because at the moment I just... Ugh. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead with something like blue. And I'm going to put it on... Well, actually, no, I'm not. I'm just going to get a little bit more concealer. Okay, so I'm going to get a little bit more of that concealer. God help me. And I'm going to try to put it on the outer corner, make it look more of a, you know, cut crease stuff. So. Okay. I'm going to do simple, simply, is I'm going to get this color over here, which is dark enough. And I'm going to use it for the outer corner and just try to blend it a little bit on this whole thing. Okay. I do not love this look, but I do not despise it either. This is not something that I would do in any other 
circumstances. So, there you go guys, you have it. I don't know how great it looks, but it doesn't look bad either. I hope, anyway. So, I'm gonna go ahead before I put the mascara on and I'm gonna go with the lower lashes and I'm going to get, obviously, that blue over here because that calls my name. Everybody's about the blue lately, so, you know, you gotta have it. And I'm putting it all over my under area. I'm just giving you whatever he gave me, so let's put on the mascara. So that's it guys, that's the best I can do. Now he picked up a lipstick, so I love this lipstick actually, it's from the Coco collection from Kylie. It's just not for this time. Of the so that's it you guys, you have it, that's the best look I can do. That's all. If you did enjoy this video because it was a fun video, please give thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos. And I'll see you again on my next video. Bye!